Hello, I'm Ken with Orion Telescopes and Binoculars, and this is the Orion uh, 10 by 50 Binocular Stargazing Kit. We've put together a kit of, first of all, the optic is a 10 by 50 bino, coupled with some uh, reference material and a flashlight in order to get you started in the hobby. Uh, let's say you're not sure you want to invest a lot of time and money into something big and heavy, uh, and you're not sure if your interest is going to hold, or if you just want something really lightweight and portable. This is a great way to do it. Uh, a 10 by 50 binocular, first of all, it's got a nice wide field of view, it's 7 degrees, uh, so it also works well for just daytime spotting, terrestrial viewing as well. But you'd be surprised what you can see in the night sky with a, ten, a pair of 10 by 50s. Panning ar across the Milky Way, you can see star clusters, star fields. Uh, if you pointed to this at the Orion Nebula, you can see some of the dust and gas, the structure of the, the little wing of the Orion Nebula. Uh, Andromeda Galaxy actually looks best, I think, in a pair of binoculars compared to a big telescope just because it's so big in the sky and you need to step back and get a wide field of view. So and, uh, the Andromeda Galaxy looks like a nice big oval structure uh, provided you can get a, a little bit away from the, the city lights and the light pollution. So uh, a great way to see the big showpiece objects in the sky if you pointed it at uh, Jupiter. You can't quite see the, the cloud bands on Jupiter, but you'd be able to see that there's four moons across uh, in, in line with Jupiter. And each night they're in a different position as they rotate around the planet. So a great way to see lots of things in the night sky. In addition to the binocular, we have some reference materials. So the binocular uh, uh, astronomy field guide gives you some reference material, tells you what you can see in the sky, what time of uh, season is best for different objects, and some helpful hints on finding things. The planisphere, the Orion Star Target planisphere, is a great way to start learning the constellations. You dial in the date to the time up on top, and you hold this above your head, and it shows you what constellations are up in what quadrant of the sky. So a great way to uh, kind of get your bearings and find where everything is. And then we give you a, uh, the Red Beam Mini flashlight. This is an LED red flashlight. It's meant to uh, uh, allow you to read these reference materials at night without killing your night vision. If you were to use a white flashlight or the, the flashlight on your phone, it would hurt your night vision. Your pupils would shrink up, and then when you're trying to look for something faint, like uh, the Orion Nebula, uh, through these, you wouldn't get the best view because you're not dark adapted. So a good way to preserve your night vision while also being able to read the material. All right, well, there you have it. This is a great beginner's uh, way to step into the hobby and get your feet wet. This is the Orion 10x50 binocular stargazing kit. Thank you very much. Clear skies.